Here's the first thing you need to know about Spy School. It sucks. Everything you hated about when you were in school, we still have here. Rigid social cliques, lousy teachers, incompetent administrators, terrible food, bullies, and on top of all of that, occasionally someone tries to kill you. Wait, you mean Chip was trying to kill you? No. Then you wouldn't have anyone left to intimidate. What do he ask you to do? Hack the school mainframe. For what? Some classified information for one of his classes? Test answers, most likely. Trips tried to force virtually everyone here into helping him cheat one way or another. And no one saw the administration? Oh, the administration knows. And they haven't kicked them out yet? This isn't your average school. We're trying to be spies, not boys guilds. You would get an A for a teen year, as long as you do it cleverly enough. So I should have tried to hack the system. Oh, heck no. You never get past the first firewall. The security council would have nailed you. Chip would have been proclaimed as innocent, and you'd have been sacrificed to a lesson to your fellow students who keep their mitts off the mainframe. But you just said Tini was okay. If you do it cleverly enough, hacking is idiocy. But anyways, all the classes aren't that bad. The computer stuff's pretty solid. Good language programs. Oh, and I definitely recommend. ICEA, Enter to dis Seducing Enemy Agents. I actually did my homework in that one. What about classes in Palm Bay and stuff? Oh no, don't tell me you're a Fleming. What's a Fleming? Someone who comes here thinking they're gonna be James Bond. Me? I wanna be a desk job. You get a good job, nice home in the suburbs, and you're all set for life. I used to be like you until I realized that it's a lot of work. And it doesn't even matter if you put that work in, because you're not gonna end up on top. She is. She is? He's a look much older than us. That's Erica Hale, Alexander's daughter. Wait, what? Why is you even save me from Chip? Chip? Well, simply put, I don't like him. I'll take any excuse to knock him unconscious. Speaking of which, here he comes now. I know you pulled that stem earlier, Mary. I don't know what you're talking about. I was in the computer lab all afternoon, nice sources that can corroborate that. Oh, well, don't give me that garbage. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Oh, I'll bet I do. You're referring to the incident where you tried to intimidate Ben here into helping you cheat because you're not capable of doing your own dirty work. But then, you let your guard down and allowed someone to knock you unconscious. Yeah, I was once talking about it. I can see why you're upset. I'd be embarrassed as tight if I got to town with my pants down like that. Think you're so smart, don't you? Not at all, Chip. I know I'm smart. Phrasing the bullet, if I had played that little trip on you, I'd sneak in a little fiber updated camera under the door and recorded an entire event. For someone like you or your girlfriend's here threatened to retaliate physically, I could threaten to send the video to the principal in return. He might not give a clue about the cheating, but he certainly won't be pleased to see how you got knocked out so easily. That's best calling self-preservation. But you didn't shock me, right? Of course not, and then you had nothing to do with it either. Well, you let who? Effort did it. Know that one of these days, I'm going to get an upper hand on him. And when I do, the wish will never cross paths with me. Is that clear? Crystal. I'm keeping my eye on you, Ben. Morons. Big muscles, very little brains. Erica, help. Please don't kill him. Rise and shine, kid. You should just see the look on your face. It was classic. Please don't kill me. Whether I kill you or not is entirely up to you. Let's see how well you play ball. What do you mean? Tell me about Pingwheel. Pingwheel? What's Pingwheel? You know damn well what it is. Don't play stupid with me. I'm not playing. I really am stupid. Are you sure you got the right guy? You're Benjamin Ripley, right? Uh, no. Then who are you? Jonathan Monkeywords. Ah! You think that's funny? You think this is all game? No, I don't. Then let's try this again. And if you try anything else, I will shoot you. What is Ping Mew? Who told you I knew about Ping Mew? What you think was in your file? The thing is, it's a well. Stop stalling or I'll shoot you. It has to do with cryptography. No kidding, it has to do with cryptography. I want to know what it does. It can does. help you circumvent a 16 rotating character daisy chain. It does? How? First, you have to set up the quadrilateral subnet matrix, then ossify the syntax, and then federate the corporate relates. Before you go on, there's two things you want to know. I'm not an idiot, and I've run out of pigeons. Don't say it in the morning.
Help! Someone's trying to kill me. What's wrong? There's an assassin in my room. He just tried to kill me. Come on, it. Stay in my room. About this assassin of yours. Oh no, did I kill him? No, I just can't seem to find him. You're claiming that someone tried to kill you tonight. You don't believe me? There's no sign of the killer or the weapon. He shot through my window. Lots of things could have broken that window. There must be a bullet. Sure. Maybe somewhere outside under five acres of snow. You really think that I trashed my own room and smacked myself around to make it look like someone tried to kill me? Why would I do that? I don't know. To get attention, maybe? The more important question is, why would someone try to kill you? You just started here. You barely passed your sacks today. If someone wanted to go through the trunk to get past all those fences and break into the dormitory to kill someone, you think they go after someone worth killing? What is it now? Thought I might be of service. I came in as soon as I heard. Where were you? Doing a little undercover work at the Russian embassy. But that's not important right now. Are you all right, Benjamin? Yes. How do you escape? Who rescued you? I did it myself. Really? How? Karani Jitsu? Tennis racket. Well, nice work. It would have been really nice if he didn't let the killer escape. It's his first night year. He hasn't had injured to deal self-defense yet, let all enemies objection and apprehension. And yet he fought out a professional assassin with a tennis racket? Maybe there wasn't a killer I know. Maybe he was just one of the older boys hazing him, and he couldn't take it. He asked me about something called pinwheel. Pinwheel? What is it? I don't know. i would never heard of it. Well, he had. He said it was in my file. Benjamin, I'd like you to think about this very carefully. What exactly did the assassin want to know about this pinwheel? He just wanted to know what it was. And what did you tell him? That I had no idea what it was, but... Then I said a handsome lady Jew with quickography, but I was only making that up. Did he believe it? He said he already knew it had to do with cryptography. He wanted to know what it did. I tried making something else up, but he knew I was lying and tried to kill me. When did he pull the trigger? Before you thought back or after? I'm not sure if he was trying to shoot me or not. Maybe he was only trying to scare me. And the gun went off. But then I hit him with the rack. Does that mean something? Perhaps, perhaps not. What? I'm Agent Coretti, crime scene investigation. I have a preliminary report on the potential assassin. It's about time. What do you have got? Nothing. No fingerprints, no blood, not single hair left behind. So, there was no assassin. I didn't say that, only that there's no concrete evidence of one. What about the surveillance cameras in the dormitories? They should have recorded something. Yes. They should have, if they hadn't been dismantled. All of them? No, not all of them, but enough of them. Although, I do request that the rest of this conversation deepen. Security, level 4C. Yes, I think that's advised. You're just gonna leave me here by myself? After someone just tried to kill me tonight? You saved yourself once. If anyone comes at you, just do it again. The light room's a crime scene. Where am I supposed to sleep tonight? Where else? In the box. <laughs> I'm an alligator I'm a mama papa coming for you I'm a space invader I'll be a rock and rolling bitch for you